Hi friends, it's December, it's getting cold and wet outside, so this is the ideal week to stay inside with this book. Now before we do, I would like to ask you to hit that like and subscribe button, because it makes all the difference. Now this book is The Thursday Murder Club by Richard Osman, the first in a series, and I haven't read any of these books yet, so I'm going in blind. But before we start to read, I'll share the synopsis with you. In a peaceful retirement village, four unlikely friends meet up once a week to investigate unsolved murders. But when a brutal killing takes place on their very doorstep, the Thursday Murder Club finds themselves in the middle of their first live case. Elizabeth, Joyce, Ibrahim and Ron might be pushing 80, but they still have a few tricks up their sleeves. Can our unorthodox but brilliant gang catch the killer before it's too late? Well, color me intrigued, so let's make some coffee and start reading. So, I'm a few chapters in already and I must say it's great fun. I mean, you have to love these characters. And while they're all, they are pushing against their 80s and they, they have a few problems like, you know, short-term memory loss and a bad hip here or there, they are not beyond using their age as a way to get their means. After all, who is going to tell off an old cute lady for being meddlesome? And that's the great, the great power of these characters in this book that you can relate. It's like visiting your nan with a bit of murder on the side, but then again, that's all the fun, right? So going to uh, go outside now, uh, walk the dog, um, maybe feed some people here in the house and uh, read some more tonight. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, it's Thursday morning now and I'm ready for round two in the Thursday Murder Club. You might also have seen me use this uh, yesterday and it always gets a lot of questions. So this is my reading light. It disguises as a notebook and it folds open like this and then it, uh, it's a reading light. It has magnets inside, you can fold it all the way around into a light or attach it to uh, a magnetic uh, surface, which is very, very uh, useful when reading on the train or in a plane or something. So I link, I link the details below if you're interested in uh, knowing more. But uh, let's get to reading now. Good morning. It's Friday morning, and I'm halfway through the book. I won't be able to read much today, however, because I'm going to my local library to work. Um, just to do some admin, st admin stuff, uh, emails, things like that. But I like to do it over there because they have a very good literary cafe, which serves uh, a very nice coffee. So yeah, might take you along. Not sure if I can film a lot, depending on how busy it is. But yeah, see you on the other side. long day I'm very tired now so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour myself uh, a nice bath take my book read some and then head off to bed and I'll see you guys tomorrow Saturday morning good morning uh, managed to read quite a lot last night so I'm almost through I'm going to do a little reading sprint and I'll share you my thoughts on this book when I'm done so I'm done reading this book and it was, it was great fun. Um, if I have to summarize it, it would be something like Miss Marple meets the Golden Girls. It has that vibe. Uh, I really loved it. It's a really funny book. I love the characters. Um, as a murder mystery, as far as murder mysteries go, um, it does throw you some uh, curveballs and I'm not always convinced it's necessary, but still that 
doesn't dampen any of the fun of reading this book. So this is the first in a series and I might be picking up uh, the next parts for sure. Uh, and who knows, you might see them uh, on this channel. So that's it for this week and I really hope you liked this video. If you want, just hit the like button and leave a comment. Um, let's say, comment what you're reading right now. And if you're not reading anything, just leave a comment of a Christmas tree. I am going to wrap up here. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next week.